This is the Wizard News. See you later, alligator. See you later, alligator. In a while, crocodile. In a while, crocodile. Bye bye, butterfly. Bye bye, butterfly. Toodaloo, kangaroo. Toodaloo, kangaroo. Time to go, buffalo. Time to go, buffalo. Give a hug, ladybug. Give a hug, ladybug. Blow a kiss, jellyfish. The Federal Trade Commission announced a final click-to-cancel rule requiring sellers to make it as easy for consumers to cancel their enrollment as it was to sign up. Most provisions will go into effect 180 days after it is published in the Federal Register, or from October 16, 2024. The 230-page rule runs the gamut from streamers to cable TV subscriptions to home shopping networks and gym memberships. Too often, businesses make people jump through endless hoops just to cancel a subscription, said Commission Chair Lina M. Khan. The FTC's rule will end these tricks and the traps, saving Americans time and money. Nobody should be stuck paying for a service they no longer want. The FTC said it acted after receiving more than 16,000 comments from the public. Source, deadline, October 16, 2024. Blow a kiss, jellyfish. Blow a kiss, jellyfish. Just like that. Fat cat. Take a bow, milk cow. Take a bow, milk cow. I'll see you soon, big baboon. See you soon, big baboon. <laughs> Studies show that our dogs miss us the moment we leave the house and their feeling slowly intensifies until we are gone for about four hours and they have a plateau of melancholy. That is why the longer you are away, the more excited your dog is when you return home. Researchers from the universities of Pisa and Perugia, Italy have found that if you give your dog some affection before you leave the house, they will have less anxiety while you are away. They conducted experiments with 10 dogs between the ages of 1 and 11 without attachment issues. The group consisted of 7 mixed-breed dogs, 1 Labrador Retriever, one Hovawat, and one Chihuahua. Participants in the study walked their leashed dogs into a fenced area where they were greeted by a researcher who took their dog's heart rate. In the first test, after the owners walked their dogs into the area, they talked with the researcher for one minute then left without giving the dog any special attention. In the second test, the dog owners petted the dog during their interaction with the researcher. 
In both tests, the owners left the fenced area and hid far enough away so that the dog could not smell them. After the owners left, the dogs looked for them for about three minutes on average. After the owners returned, the researchers measured the dog's level of the stress hormone cortisol as well as their heart rates. The researchers found that whether the dogs were petted or not, their cortisol levels were unchanged. But their heart rate showed a marked decrease if their owners petted them before leaving. Researchers watched videos of the dogs and found that the ones that were petted showed behaviors indicative of calmness for a longer period while waiting for the owner's return. Source Upworthy, October 15, 2024. I think I'm losing my. Samba in the rhythm of the people from Angola, from Luanda.